Welcome back to Trends and Friends. I'm joined by Joe Moore from the Texas Tech Presidential Lecture and Performance Series. And Texas Tech Presidential Lecture and Performance Series is in full swing. And the next event is right around the corner. And of course, we are going to uh, dive right in. You have a pretty spectacular artist who's going to be joining us for she one is. night only. She is, Heidi. It's Friday, November 16th. So okay. that's a week from this Friday. And her name is Gina Chavez. And okay. she's, she's one of Texas's own. She's from Austin. And she's a Latin pop singer who sings in both English and Spanish. So she's Wonderful. a bilingual singer. She has a really smooth, Latin, jazzy, soulful sound. So she'll have her whole band, lots of percussion. Um, she's just terrific. So Wonderful. looking and forward to her coming. You mentioned to me earlier she's uh, won just a few awards. Uh, talk she about has. her background. She has. So again, she's an Austin artist. She's won nine times for Austin Music Awards, and in 2015 was Austin's Musician of the Year. And I had no heard, big deal. No big deal. I had heard her perform in New York after watching her on a national public radio does a little vignette called Tiny Desk Concerts. Okay. And she's absolutely fantastic. And people can go on our website and see a clip, or they can, you know, access her through YouTube. And just check in, her out. just in case you didn't entice them enough just now with her, you know multiple awards, yes. you know, Artist of the Year. What are you hoping she's going to bring to the series that's a little bit different from what you've been seeing in the past? Well, I think that she's going to bring a Latin flair. We try okay. to bring world music every year some in some form or fashion. And I think because she is bilingual, um, it's not just, you know, Hispanic music. It's not just, you know, um, Americana music. It's a really wonderful blend. So. I think it's really going to be fun for people to see her. She's young, she's fresh, she's innovative, she has a beautiful voice, and, and is funky and neat. I just think people will really enjoy it, students and community. And as always, it's free for students. So okay. all they have to do is go to the Student Union Building, to the info desk outside the theater, and pick up a free ticket, which are available now. And then other tickets are available through Select a Seat for $20. It's the best deal in town. Okay, wonderful. Now, is this welcome to children or is it more adults? Oh, no, children can come. Okay. Yeah. Okay, and you mentioned it's an hour and a half long show. Is there an intermission? And there's, is there food and drinks? There's not an intermission, and we don't have concessions at okay. the Allen, so people need to eat and drink before they come. And so we have an hour and a half show. There'll be a CD signing. She'll be selling t shirts afterwards Wonderful. and have an opportunity to meet people. So I think that's going to be cool. I love it. And of course, you guys have complimentary parking. We do. So you we don't do. have to worry about that. You do and not. This is a great way to spend it uh, on Friday, your Friday Correct. night. So it's not this Friday, but it's the upcoming. Friday. Correct. It's 7 o'clock. Okay, perfect. Um, are there a lot of tickets left or should people start buying online quickly? You know, Lubbock is a last minute town, but yes. we encourage people <laughs> to go ahead and get their tickets. Uh, doors will open at 630. It's general admission seating. So people, you know, if you get there early, you'll get the best seat. Of and course. then the show starts at 7. Wonderful. And can you buy tickets at the door if you are yes, one of those can. usual last minute people? You can. You can as long as they're available. Okay, yeah. perfect. Yeah. Thank you so much for joining us today. Going to be a really fun Thank event. You, and again, it's one night only to see this wonderful artist yes. who's a little bit different from what you've seen maybe in the past here in Lubbock. Right. So should be a lot of fun. And coming up, details on a Veterans Day event you won't, won't want to miss. That's next.